Imagine you're sitting inside a train. When you look out the window, trees seem to move backward. But for someone standing on the platform, you are the one moving. It's basically the point of view from which you observe motion. To describe an object's position, velocity, or acceleration, you must define the frame you're measuring from. Now, frames can be of two types. One, inertial frame, a frame that's either at rest or moving with constant velocity. Here, Newton's laws hold true. Example, the person standing on the platform. Two, non-inertial frame, a frame that's accelerating or rotating. In such frames, fictitious forces like centrifugal force appear to explain motion. Example, the person inside the accelerating train feels pushed backward. So remember, motion is always relative to the chosen frame of reference. And to apply Newton's laws correctly, make sure your frame is inertial.